good evening students so we are doing the third chapter mixtures and their separation of chemistry so today we have come to the second part of this chapter and this is the final part of this chapter and here i would teach you the various techniques for the separation of mixtures now before i teach you the various techniques of separation first we need to know why separation of mixtures uh, is needed so there are three main reasons why do we need for separation of mixtures are to remove a harmful or undesirable constituent to obtain a useful substance to obtain the pure sample of a substance now what do you understand by to remove a harmful or undesirable constituents like take water water has got dissolved microorganisms clay salt uh, sand oil various things in it and we cannot drink that water because it has got these undesirable things like oils and clay salts microorganisms like bacteria fungi algae so these are undesirable substances and we cannot drink that water so to get pure water drink drinkable water we need to remove these undesirable constituents from water for that reason we need the separation of the mixture of water along with these undesirable substances and also you might have seen your mother or your grandmother in their free time they are sitting and separating the rice from the small pieces of stones or husk hand picking them so, and then only they cook the rice and pulses so this is what the stones pieces of stones and husks are undesirable constituents and it should be removed from the rice or pulses before it is cooked next is to obtain a useful substances like the petrol which you get in the petrol pump it is not available in the nature in that way petroleum or crude oil is available in the nature which is actually mixture of various compounds and this mixture or petroleum or crude oil is separated from their various compounds uh, by the process of refining by the process of refining and the com compounds which you obtain by refining petroleum or crude oil are also known as fractions so you get uh, substances like paraffin wax that is the normal wax okay and then uh, diesel kerosene petrol now this is the petrol which is used for running the vehicles then we have got uh, uh, petrol diesel and various other things okay and also to obtain the pure sample of a substance now you have number of times you have seen doctor giving you antibiotics antibiotics are medicines which are not avail uh, which are actually filed in a bottle in powder form along with that powder form uh, in the bottle in the file you will find a white bottle which contains simple water this water is distilled water which is pure form of water which contains no, no dissolved mixed compounds in it so elements or compounds in it so if it is not distilled water your medicine would get waste and you would not be able to get that pure good medicine so for that you need that pure form of water for that for preparing medicine and various other purposes we need to obtain the pure sample of a substance so these are the main three reasons for uh, that we need for separation of mixtures okay